crap, that's weird. Look at my arm. I'll have you choose a number between one and a hundred. This is one of those nights where it is like 8.30 and I still don't have anything for tomorrow's video. So, we have been wanting to do this idea for a while. Zach found a really cool list of questions to ask your spouse. Is it your spouse? To ask just anyone like to like get to know them. Interesting now. questions to get to know you. And they're pretty funny. So, we're going to ask a couple of <clears> these <throat> questions to each other to get to know each other better. And, and for, for you. you to get to know us better too. I'm Tara, this is Zach, and your lives will never be the same again. Okay, so you need to choose a number between one and a okay, hundred or something, choose, and then I'll... Okay, I'm gonna choose 47. Okay. What is the last book you read? The last, you guys know what the last book I read was, hopefully. I it know. Was Harry Potter and the Cursed Child. What's your last book? Let's say that. The last book I read, the last book I read was... Are we talking audiobook? Because he listens to a lot of books. Yeah. Either one, audiobook or, or real. Man, I'm having a hard time even remembering the last audiobook I read. Probably like Good to Great. That might have been the last like audiobook I read. I think there was some other ones before there, but that's the one that's sticking out. Good to Great and Harry Potter. You should Potter. check it out. It's a great book. He reads better books than me. Okay, next question. 83. If you could kill any character from a current television show, who would it be? Oh, it has to be a current television show? Yeah. Because I was going to say I would kill Lord Grantham. <laughs> because he's Lord a, Grantham. He's a bum on Downton Abbey. <laughs> um, oh, what about Stranger Things? Stranger Things? Oh, well, I know who I would kill, but I don't want to give away any spoilers. That's, oh. He's already, he's already dead. Well, spoiler alert, if you haven't seen this yet, then cover your ears for a second. Who would you kill in Stranger Things? Well, he's dead now, so it's hard the to Papa. say. Papa? Yeah, that guy. Yeah. Papa! <laughs> Papa! Yeah, he, is, he needed to go. Oh, is Howard Stern still a judge on America's Got Talent? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. He's a real person, though. So, that's a fictional character. <laughs> Next no, question. Funny. Okay, let's do number... Aren't there, like, more than 100? No, there's just 100. Oh, let's do number 14. If you were offered the position of mayor of your city, would you take it? <laughs> yeah. We might have to do another one. That's I would take important. it. Okay, why? I would like to be a mayor. I like leader. I, I like. I feel like I could be a leader of some kind. So here's the here's the question. And I like I get to wear cool like clothes. <laughs> like I like to get. You want to wear like, like a pantsuit like and like yeah, I think blazers and yeah, stuff. Yeah, girl, girl, professional. Women. Yeah, women. Sorry, professional attire for women is so cute nowadays. Yeah, um, here's my question for you because I recently had. I ran for president of the of my section and I didn't win, and so I'm wondering, Tara, what what's like your platform? What would your what would you do to like? Uh, no, they said they offered me the job, so I don't have to petition. Them. Okay, to... you're right, you're right. But what like what, now you're in office? Like, what do you do? What's like what's gonna be like? Your I would big get thing? freaking recycling in Provo. That's a good one. Cause they don't have recycling here, and really bothers me. I'm not like super like green about everything, but no recycling. I know. They like have it, but it's like you have to go to extreme great lengths to like drop yeah. off your stuff, and it's like so weird. Should just be so everywhere. that's what I would do, City of Provo. If you elect me as your mayor, I would get recycling. Dosh Garnet, Dar <laughs> Gosh, Dosh, Dosh Garnet, Gosh darn it. <laughs> I would not because I'm too busy right now. <laughs> yeah. That's probably that's probably for the best. But yeah, you wanna do one more? Yeah, we'll do, do one, one more. more. What number should we do? Just kidding. Hey. Why don't you comment below uh, your favorite number between one and a hundred that we haven't done yet, and maybe we'll do that number. Maybe another day <laughs> we'll <months>. answer it. <laughs> okay, um, you choose another number. Or answer these questions for yourself. Yeah, yeah. Let us know what your answers are underneath. Let's go sixty-three. Sixty-three. What bad habit do you have that you know you need to break but don't really want to? Well, I think that's an easy one. Because I really, for, for me, I really want to be like healthy, but I don't want to eat healthy. <laughs> so that's like the hard one is like, I really want to be like fit and skinny and awesome and work out and have like a six pack and like everything shiny and cool. <laughs> but like, I, I really don't like right now, especially have any like Willpower. desire to like change anything about how I'm eating other than like, I mean, that's not true. I do want to like eat better, but. It's just so hard when like all day there's like free pizza and free J dogs, hot dogs, and like just everything yeah. free and fattening and delicious. Yeah, food so. is food is hard. Um, Don't quote me on that. 
My habit that I probably need to change is sleeping in. The kids wake me up every day because they wake up before me. I wish I could wake up at a like earlier time than I, cause they're very regular, like seven o'clock they walk through my door. If I could just wake up at like 6.30, like set my alarm, wake up 6.30, I could get some things done and my day would go a lot smoother, but I just don't want to wake up. I hate waking up, it's the worst part of my day. <laughs> Are you totally cool with like the amount of TV you watch and stuff? Yeah, I'm cool with the amount of TV I watch because I like TV and I don't watch too much. I mean, I binge sometimes and then like, then it's over though. So yeah, I wish I could break the bad habit of sleeping in or at least the bad habit of not waking up early. But the reason you don't want to is because you know that like, yeah, I have baby this thing. On. Yeah, I have this thing where I know there's a new baby coming and I know I'm not going to be getting enough sleep then. So I like, oh, I better sleep in now because I'm not going to okay. get to. Oh, can I show you something? Oh my gosh, the kids are like out of bed again. Yeah, okay, we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like and comment. You know what time it is. <laughs> time to go to bed. Can I have to show you something? Yeah.